Hey, Internet, it's Dark Strider. We all know that the Eternal Maw is the horse that you get while you're in the afterlife. As soon as you get in there, you whistle for your horse, no matter what you have equipped, only the Eternal Maw shows up. Now, there's a trophy or achievement for getting it outside in the real world, and that's where I am right now. Now, the area that I'm in is right here, the stables by Setmat, which is opposite of Thebes over there. All right. Now I completed the game, and now I'm going directly to can the merchant here, you and you'll see that for 5,000 drachma, we can get the Eternal Maw. All right. So here we go. Have the horse Always and unlock the trophy. So we'll go to our gear, go over to our horse. And where are you, buddy? There you are, the Eternal Maw. So there you have it. Now we can have it both inside and outside of the afterlife. You could have it anywhere, any place. It's actually a pretty cool looking horse. Uh, very kind of like old and rustic looking uh, armor, which is cool. It almost looks like the first Civ armor, but not glowy and stuff like that. It's just a really cool looking uh, horse, like both inside and outside. So anyway, that's how you do it. I have no idea if you could do it sooner. I've actually tried doing it sooner and after several missions, and I haven't been able to find it. I've also tried going through Egypt, Sinai, and everything like that, and the rest of the area of the Valley of the Kings, trying to see if I could find this horse or, or buy it before defeating the game, or the DLC, actually. So anyway, that's how you do it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. And just let me know what you think of the horse. Is it a cool horse? Would you pay 5,000 drachma for it? Do you want to just try to see if you can get out of a heck of chest? Let me know in the comments below. Mm -hmm. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.